the true moment. Oh boy, we have a tug pulling our create contraption. How do you handle corners? It's comical. <laughs> All right, we're planting trees. Taking the contraption around just fine. See if it drops stuff off. Boom, it's interacting. What did it get? It would get cactus. That's filled up more than it was. Now I just got to wait for trees to grow. But I think we got this thing working. Let me show you something else that they added to the pack too. I have another create contraption over here. That's just running on rail tracks cart goes back and forth harvesters are harvesting what i've been using for food which is stir fry which is a mixture of different vegetables and olive oil and then we also need a bunch of this stuff right here what's this stuff called infernium inferium essence to make creative flight for later on but this is something new these are plants from thermal that were added what is this called this is called a flux tube spore let me get out of the way before i die to that and that grows a redstone. There's also another one that I found that's called a glimmer cap spore that grows glowstone. You need a light source block in order for these to grow and they also have to be planted on top of mycelium. Now they grow extremely slow and you get a bunch of the spores as well as redstone and glowstone. The spores can't be used for anything right now I'm imagining they might add a recipe where you could turn it into bone meal or something later in the future, but there's nothing right now. So these are planted on mycelium. You cannot bone meal these to make them grow any faster. So what I ended up doing was I put these down. These are called lily pads of fertility. And if you notice the green things around each plant, that in essence is doing what bone meal would do if you stood there and bone mealed the plant. So this has been growing since I started setting up that area over there. And I have 4,000 redstone and 4,000 glowstone. Take another look at these spores. There's only one other way to grow these really. And it's in a phytogenic insulator. Or you can just grow them on the ground. This, you can just add water, boom, you get the redstone and you get your flux tooth spore back. And then you can just recycle it and keep duplicating redstone but i don't really have a good source for power yet that's what i'm working on and we're going to use potatoes for that i need to up the storage of this because we're going to need a boatload of potatoes and that's for the future but i just wanted to show off this thing is this thing working or did it die what's going on over here i thought this was mighty cool if it works died already What happened? Tugboat. Be way cooler than you are. Vehicle chain. Boom. You're connected. You're also dead. So now I guess I got to figure out a way to take you with a lead and bring you all the way back to the beginning. Why does it break going around the corner? I need a revamp. Lead back. Thank you. It's gonna work now. I have a feeling this might be janky. How do you get it to go around the turn? I think there's an issue with these. Not sure. Maybe I'm the bot. But I feel like I did it the way it told me to do it. Still get stuck on this corner block. They tell you to put that there. Get rid of them? It probably isn't at all, but we'll try it. There's the real test.
I have one more thing I'm willing to try before giving up on this. We're going to use these tug guide rails. The powered rails. Tugboat. Chain. <laughs> Tugboat. Chain. Lead. Out of there. Wait. All right, let's try this. So if we take a wrench, I can get rid of these blocks on the corner. Maybe put some of these in to help it, or it's going to hurt it more. We need this thing. We need the lever. We need to turn that on. We need to get rid of these blocks. Hopefully <laughs> it now works. All right, picked it up, dropping its items off. That part's working fine. That's good. You make it around the corner. Time to eat. My guess is no. Minecraft is a world full of imagination. We just imagined that this tug worked the way it should. It would be really cool. But unfortunately, I can't figure it out. So if you guys have any clues on how to make one of these work, please let me know in the comments down below. For now, I'm just going to go with the tried and true method of putting railroad tracks in place of where this tugboat is. And we should be good to go. To solve our issue with a rail cart. Ten. Boom. We sent a rail cart back and forth. Turn this on. And we can now pretend. That's a boat. That's water. Looks really cool. How do you work? Oh, I don't know. So cool with the boat going back and forth like that. 